Uh, hello guys, I, uh, we do the haul video right now, a short one, and, uh, the first thing I got was this, uh, Danger, Messy Room Ahead sign. It was only 99 cents, I gotta take that off, uh, right now my room is messy, so why not put that on my doorway, so. And, uh, the good, the good world I went to wasn't called Goodwill, it was called Goodwill Store, I assume that it's more cleaner than Goodwill. Uh, and there was some unopened toys, a lot of them, like, I mean, a lot, um, maybe someone was going to invest in them, but, uh, didn't feel like it, so he just donated a good will, so, sadly, I can find like, I need Lego, so, uh, here's the only thing, Lego, uh, it's from eBay, I got, uh, the shipping took about one week, because, uh, I got this from all the way from Hong Kong, on China, and it was three bucks, um, pretty good deal, um, Three bucks, uh, free shipping. No, I mean the shipping was only thirty-five cents. So here it is. Uh, it's a small packet. I'm just gonna show you the bag. Because on the front is my address. So yeah, it's this keychain. Oh, but what what seam is it? Um, ah, oh, crap! I almost showed you the back. Um, so let's just open this. I'm gonna use a scissor because I can't open this with one hand. So. I still have to uh, find the place to put these sets. So, so I gotta open. So here it is. The uh, tack, the uh, tack. Uh, Takashi from the Exo Force line. Uh, as you may know, I'm a big Exo Force fan, so of course I got this. It was only three dollars, so it's fun. 2006, the uh, original Takashi. Um, I uh, here's all my um, four main guys. I have uh, the ones in the bags are complete. I have uh, Haiku, I think it is. Um, forgot his name. Uh, Takashi and. I'm missing the hair pieces to this because I uh, traded this for my friend and uh, these two are kind of damaged. Uh, the heads are kind of cute off because you know I got this back in 2006. Same goes to this and it's the print is just coming off a little bit. You know what? Um, I count them as minifig, not complete, but I still count them as minifig. I'm gonna put them in bags soon. So, yep. So I guess you could say now I have three uh, complete minifigs. I don't know, um, she did great, did, uh, she did a great, uh, oh, what was I gonna say, um, she did a great job on the packaging, uh, like she just, uh, open this. Like I told you it was 23 bucks, so that was a good deal, I mean, I bet when this came out it was like 5 bucks, um, I don't, I don't, I don't think 5 bucks is a good deal. I think that's too expensive. I'd rather buy like three Lego minifigs for six bucks and just pay one dollar more to get uh, you know two minifigs. So here it is. Uh, you, if you want them, you could go on the eBay and look at uh, look him up. He's still on the eBay. Uh, he has like about ten left. So here it is. The uh, usually we have the tag to it. Um, six and plus. I'm not gonna take this off because. Uh, Because, um, I don't pull out my backpack because, you know, I have a locker, so if I put my backpack in there, it's just going to ruin the minifig, so. I think the head doesn't come, uh, the minifig doesn't come off the whole keychain. Um, in the image, he showed me that the head could twist, so let's try that. Uh, nope, he doesn't. Um... The old Lego keychains used to have this uh, Lego piece on it, so that's why I like this mini uh, thing a lot. Uh, this kind of looks like Chinese plastic. Maybe I hope th I hope this is the uh, is this was actually from 2006. Um, 
I hope he didn't make it. We um, it kind of looks kind of you know made by Chinese recently. Um, because um, uh, uh, Lego keychains nowadays they say Lego Exo Force, but this doesn't. So, I mean, uh, nowadays uh, if the keychain you know this is Exo Force, so it should say Exo Force, but it doesn't. So uh, I don't know. But still, it was three bucks, so great deal. Um, yeah, so that's my whole video. Uh, sorry, it took five minutes. I like to talk a lot, so uh, I'll be posting a video soon. So bye for now.